Soviet and Russian scientists contributed a lot to the development. It's a special pleasure to be here for this very important event, marking a landmark in U.S.-Russian aviation cooperation for future supersonic space flight. So the idea appeared to join efforts of aviation designers and aviation... And this is a very special occasion of bringing this plane out of storage and putting it into a flight test program for all of us to gain some valuable technical research information for the 21st century airplanes. Nobody has built a supersonic transport since this plane and the Concorde were built. So this is still the state of the art for a supersonic transport.